Hey guys, my name is Cursor Raw. Sorry about that. Apparently, my uh, first video um, of this was overheating, so and kind of overheat, and uh, it, I was just loading into a level like this, and somehow my console decides to say that the game was has an error. So we're going to try this again, and hopefully we don't really bug out. And oh yeah, this game has got Warhammer, Warhammer 40,000 um, Inquisitor Martyr, but again, like like I was just saying in the last video, or well, the beginning video, it, the game crashed on me, before the game crashed on me, I went and bought all the DLCs, so it made the, the level ones I didn't buy, any of the, the uh, cosmetic stuff, because again, I'm not that bothered about it. <sighs> it's a pain of my ass. So I might I'll, again. This is just a little highlight video. So if you want to see more of this, let me know in the comments below. But it is a quite an old game, and it kind of makes me feel like I'm playing Diablo, which again, um, <coughs> eh. Yeah. Because I've been playing that a lot, and I knew that game was like really old, and I went and had a lot of so. Right, here we go. So I'm carrying the bolt, right, and this is the normal attack. Right there. And this is the awap attack, which is pretty It's so good. You all have to be so. And also, um, for each armor, each armor has its own uh, um, has its own abilities. So right now, I'm wearing I am wearing the uh, what, what was it? This armor? No. This one, uh, demolition armor. And as you can see, there's like two big massive missile pods. So I kind of want to keep this armor until I can get a better version of it. Um, and I love it. it. Also, it gives you like the the ability, but it tells you about what assist damage you can you can take. So much resistant damage, resistant damage, and, oh, and, and also deduction. And it gives you a bit. Of, it gives you more HP, which I love to see in this game. And you get two different sets, so you get set one, big bolter, and if you go here, here's my normal bolter with a scope on it, and you don't go in the scope. The way this game is, you can't do that. <coughs> uh, and I'm just doing, I'm just basically just having fun working that way. And th this is how this game is so easy. Cause I don't know if you noticed. Uh, it has like a tracking system. So I, I was aiming at that that hallway and it basically shred. You know? Absolutely shredding with any others and switch weapons is just a white arrow pad. Uh, let's see. Okay, so there's a big map somewhere. There's like you can find loot in here as well. Which, um, <coughs> uh, sometimes you get lucky by getting in, uh, like the orange, like the high tier stuff, and, and I don't think, and there's no way like, buying, like, there's no other that, um, stuff like all you need to buy crates to get from the store, from the PlayStation, none of that. Um, the only way you can get stuff like that is, uh, Is to get more of let's see uh, inventory. I think it was. Yeah. So see the little purple, <coughs> so the purple tokens. That's how you can buy them. You can buy them and all that. And again, each difficulty you can get way about five or maybe more. Um, I haven't really tried the higher difficulties yet, but I'm considering it. And. 
This is what I want. Okay. This is what you call Titan armor. I might a big Iron Man. 2.3.0. Just shred them. Now, I don't know much about the lore, but the visitors, if they were all like this, wearing big bulky armor, just being the badass what they are. But they kind of look cool, in my opinion. And I'm not even going on. Epic. Again, this game is just too good. I, it's easy. You just shoot and then you just go have it. And oh, so hold on. Um, for health wise, it will regen and that green way up to the yellow to the red. If that hits yellow, you've been suppressed, but if it hits right down to the red, danger, then you have to like, try and escape or you can be like, pinned or something. And for your health, it's just a... Uh, no. Armor. And you get a good amount of UCs right here. Also, the best part is if you're in range, and you, if, if you're in a bit of distance from them while you're shooting them, you can do like a chain attack, uh, chain damage, which that's epic. Like you get, you see a wee bit of electricity and it just kills them, depending on how strong their health are. <coughs> but again, it's a full, it's a, it is a full player co-op, and. You're basically just wrecking. You're, you're like a, a big ass, a badass face. Just wrecking. And I know I'm a chaos mate, but I'm giving it a to actually enjoy this because I love Warhammer. Um, not good with the war, but I can play. I'm fun with it, you know? I can't fun with the game. Proud to know. Loading. And also, uh, I'll show you some of the, the DLC stuff. It doesn't have really affect or anything with the main story. This is what main story stuff is doing. But again, you'll be amazed how. It took it wrong, this is an actual game, but it still works good to this day. I'm gonna try what I'm gonna do is before I at the end of the before the end of the video I will try out the uh, PvP and see what that's like. Don't get me wrong though, I know I'm gonna be shit. I never really tried it, but we're gonna see if there's any players are still still active to play this game. If there are then Again, I still, I don't really talk about about me, me about me, about Warhammer, because again, I love Warhammer. Um, it's like my favourite hobby. Like getting more of it. I even got the winning game, Imperial Knights. found him, Captain, but it's too late. Tech Priest seems beyond repair. Switching language module from Kant Mechanicus to Gothic. A 
Apologies, Imperator. Proceed. Thank the Emperor. I've come for you. I'll explain everything later. Now, let's get out of here. Oh, and also, you sometimes get backup, which is great. It's the best thing. You get with all the Imperium soldier boys to come out. The way I'm saying it, I feel like I'm being an uh, I'm 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 being an orc. God damn. Right, well, I better take out my big, my big boy gun. Because I like shredding. Oh yeah, the other thing is you start off facing the chaos, the Nurgle, the Great Marines and stuff when you face with the Great Marines and You first start off fighting an Elf Group. You first start off fighting an Elf Group. Not your credit. Even sometimes if you destroy shit, it, you get like a good amount. That's it. So that's the weird thing. You know what's funny? I, while I was trying to record that, uh, on this, the game crashed. I didn't see any issues with that. I even checked the PS4 Pro because um, I need to keep it. And I don't know why that's over here. It's nowhere near the wall. I double checked it. I even made sure of it because I was playing. Uh, I was playing a game with my friend and it never had this issue. Oh, oh. As promised, it tells you what you get, which is cool. Because again, I don't know much about all the chapters for the Space Marines with the Dictus Mechanicus. No Dictus Mechanicus, the Starties. You know, wait, like, I'm not a big like, uh, I don't have a big brain for that, but I do know that there's Dark Angels, there's the Imperium Fist, Blood Ravens, which they're my favourite, Ultramarines, and now Imperium Fist are my favourite, so I got like three of my favourites for that, but for Chaos style wise, I like the Word Bearers, but my main has to be the Black Legion, because I'm a big fan of their. Like, big ass army. They have weak cultists. They're, they're very weak. I was certain, our new guest. I'd fights, like to talk to him immediately. The tech priest is being treated <coughs> with injuries, although he doesn't you seem get to be the, concerned get the, about the organic they know how damage, they get the job as he done. puts it. What of the remaining deserters? Their leader, Colonel Anderson, has slipped away with a Colonel. small force. I must commend why, Lord why Prosperheim for recruiting master. highly effective assets. I hate assets. when games have this my ass. Anderson is indeed well, a resilient trying and cunning man. Closer to my name. Why? I hate this. So, now, to order to check everything what you got, you can always do this, and it gives you like a good um, style, like what does what. 
again, I'm not getting rid of my heavy bolter or my uh, my standard bolter because I'm a big geek. Because again, I love big weapons and I can't get rid of them to save myself, especially the armor. Again, each armor has its own uh, special move, like right, for the L2 and R R2. But so far, you know what? I might end up just selling all these because again I have that much and even if I had friends that was new to this I'll be happy to try and give them it but in the meantime it's only me sadly but you can get like big frame for us and all that if you get lucky doesn't matter what what class you play as you get like heavy you get some good ass big ass whims and that was a purple Okay, I should have looked at that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. We don't need this green shit. side you can buy the uh, well technically you can buy that and it's like a bonus stuff for your for the, for the next five missions but you can also get wait other stuff and depending on the level you play as you can wait actually have fun but for the credits you get that's how you buy them which they are freaking annoying to get but hey I'm happy I'm giving give it a go, but I do have enough for the orange, the Omega pack, but I'm not going to be spending them just yet because I want to see if I can get lucky, um, very, very lucky. So I just need to find any of this. It's one of those old dinky fucking items that you need to look for. It was a purple. If I can find it, but I have a bad. Bad, 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 bad. So that's what I've been doing. I've just been kicking ass, drew some names, and then if I will, if I'm got lost where I'm going, it tells me here. So we're going to go back in it here. We're going to do two more missions for here, and then we'll do one big uh, actual jet to thing. Uh, wait, is this the uh, frozen points campaign mission? Right. And again, they have Elder, they have all some of the types of the Chaos, but they don't just have the not the good Elder, they have the Dark Elder as well. But they also have Tony's, which they are pain in the ass. Again. No, I didn't pick that, I want that thing. Yep. Uh, let's go where I go. <coughs> so, you, you will see similar levels designing like this um i've been in this in this area well in this type of area a few good number of times which again it's not too wait like, too big to get size for or get annoyed for because again you don't really you don't miss them you don't miss like, the areas sure some areas it's new and whatnot but half of the time <coughs> uh Half of the time, you you just forget about them. You don't want to have to worry about God and think about, oh, was that ever again? Oh well, yeah, I just did that one. Because yeah, again, they had more DLC on the time, and I think the DLCs are going to be more worth it. So I'll well see what's the next up for that would be.
So basically this is all hunting for enemies, so we're going to have a lot of fun. And I like for fighting looking for enemies. Nice. And if you want to, can you slide? No, you can't slide. Ow! How wood? The health just goes down by seconds in this. Have fun with the no water, and down is where get your 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 map up. That's a uh, yeah, that's a key, that's a land wider, land wider. Okay, uh, okay. move this. I can go through here, so that's okay. So basically, you're just running for enemies. Certain missions is where you oh, hunt, uh, kill all enemies in, all, in the one map, and you just do it. It's amazing. The missions and the objectives for me is way so easy. I can actually have fun, and I won't have to worry about no trying to try and survive from a certain target. And kill, you know. But I didn't die yet in this game. Funny enough. Because I did go about like a high level and well I went into a mission that it had like Loading <coughs> It had like uh It had like a higher level and I was thinking wait a minute how am I getting my ass kicked and I was almost died if I survived it to be honest I did survive it It was so chaotic I'm glad they had the Oh, and I have to pull my map. Sight the area or effect. Okay. Uh, still not got the, the health that, the, that meter down here. Let's check down here. Where, where Sometimes you bring the map up, it's worth it. Sometimes the more area you clear, and that's just why you Sorry for the Imperial Guardsmen when they try and see when they fight him. Because the weapons he's got, it makes holes on their way through them. It pushes way through them. And you get his different squad. How big is this? Right, so the know there. Actually, I'm gonna go and check at the bottom. Since we're at the bottom area, I'll have a peek. You can see the outline. Right, if I go in the where the right patch is, you see that. You can see how big the map is for scale when you bring up the map. Mini map. So that's how you can tell how big the map is. Sometimes you get lost and you have to end up like pull the map. Sorry, you have to pull the map out. See where you need to go. Sometimes you get all red, all red icons, and that indicates where you need to go.
should be fine now. Hopefully, because we're still got. Thank God, I don't even know how many of these enemies are. Turns out I'm not fighting a lot of big, big heavy units. But also, the funny thing is, the reason why I'm saying this reminds me of uh, um, Diablo. You know how the old treasure cob, the old uh, treasure goblin creature. Well, there's a, like a special little unit um, in this game that it runs away from you, and you have to keep on shooting it. Now he can drop some good loot and some good damage. Oh, I'm hitting like some weird build thing. Again, what do you guys think about this game? I, I don't know if any of you guys are big, uh, wait, big Warhammer fans, but there are some games that wait for Warhammer. Type of game is not for me and whatnot. And <sighs> right, because Dawn of War 3, when that came out, a lot of people were hyped about it, but the only problem is the time when they realized how shit it was, it kind of ruined the franchise. And then within, then a while later, uh, about, wait, I don't know how long. After that, and when it came stop uh, making more games, they want to be out. And there's been with like, good people, right? There are good people who made mods for that Dawn of War scene. They crashed it. And it's amazing how. It's amazing how they still continue with it. You know, for that fun factor of it, and it's amazing. It's, it's good though. Look at all I'm glad people are making mods. Like, try different, try the campaign again, but this time with different setup or you know. Resident Evil, which is cool. And this is the guy here. 
Now, he will retreat. He will want half of the time, but he's doing a good favor for me. He's staying close. So this is a good one. Reloading. Big fat bit right at the back here. So let's check here and then we'll go down the middle and then we'll clear them out. I might open up stuff when I've already got my like, max inventory, my mixed uh, gadgets and stuff. Just cover that a little bit up. Clear everything in this game. But yeah, you can again, you can be, you can have like one being a sniper class, I think, because there is like ones you can actually like, actually shred them. And each class works amazing. But I went with like, heavy. Usually I take the map out, take, bring the map up and then I end up. And if I do this, he actually finds them. And... Yeah, again, Waffer. I love when it does that. and it's got your name on them. Someone's firing all the strikes at me. Oh, what a cheap way. Oh, what a cheap way. I won't die by it, so it's alright. I got plenty of help. I'm on a kill streak. Get off them, the snow piece. I think I'll get Don't know why that would make it as a threat, but I'll take it. So, how's your day? Yeah. I'm just doing work. Yeah, I'm just holding one button. It just shreds them. Alright, fuck, I knew it. This way it was here. And I can't fucking see because the map is waiting sometimes for it and I don't forget. Oh, chest! <coughs> Getting amazing good loot. Stop it, God. Wait, where were we? Oh, yeah, that's right. Alright, okay. Let's 
still have many, but that's good. Drop? No. Leave. I don't know how much, how, how many bullets do this thing carries. But. Oh, oh yeah, they're mine. Yeah. Epic, 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 epic. Right. Now we can wait, explore here and see if there was anything else. But half of the time that it doesn't show you all the icons. Oh, oh you found this chest. Good. Know that. But I don't want to like, stay on the map too long because usually I just wait to move on to the next chest. We're done. There you go. Beam me up, Scotty. Oh, wrong franchise. My bad. Haven't fought them yet. These hellish dogs. They're the chaotic hellhounds. Because of the the icon on the on the ass cheek. See yep, in the left butt cheek. Oh, probably the right butt cheek. I don't know. <sighs> but that was fun, I like that. I should have just put that on a higher difficulty. I didn't know what was the objective, because I don't really pay attention or read it. I just go in there just to say, okay, kill. Okay, cool. Kill time. Kill kill enemies. To face three others. Nice. Alright, let's get this. Inquisitor, you have a message from the Caligari Conclave. I am Inquisitor Helena Gosla, and I have an assignment for you. I am aware that you are conducting a highly classified investigation for the Conclave at the moment, although I must admit I don't know any further details. To my utter amazement, my clearance was deemed insufficient to access your records. In other words, I can't command you to abandon your main investigation, but the Conclave would appreciate if you could take another case as well travel to the hive world of Atheon Prime and look into yeah. the case of the mass disappearances that has baffled the adept so there's hive shit in this in case you are wondering why you are tasked with such a trivial like issue the, the I want you to watch a highly confidential picked recording it was made by an infiltrator of the Inquisition <clears throat> and as you will see it proves the existence of some unholy machinations on Atheon Prime I must also add that this recording was made 30 standard years ago I hope I have your interest now, Inquisitor. The Emperor protects. <sighs> Chaos ships. Lovely. Don't know what legion they're in. I think they're bar I think I think they're the Bright region. Are they? Oh, there you go. They look cool though. You gotta admit, uh, seeing that looks amazing but terrifying. New crew. Hmm. Well, I'm f I'm fine. I don't know about that, but anywho, I'm going to try doing a some assignment, and then we're going to do a battle PvP, if anyone's still in it, but if not, then Mark can always try and do it one time. No, this is just a map thing, but I'm going to give it a go, because I did, I'm overpowered in this, and I can't really change the difficulty, which is a shame with shit but I'll give it a go and each ma each uh, add-on 
level map contains right new stuff you can get and it's amazing right i don't really check my inventory as much until i do like a group of like, three or four missions in the main campaign and then i move to this and then once i've done this i check the my inventory and if it's worth anything it's good if it's anything to keep then i'll keep it until i make a decision about it Because I thought in this game you just see the quiz that are there in the intro and then after that you see the, you, you become like a special unit of a space marine, like from the start or something, but I was what. Well. Intelligence assets report several vulnerable cogitator stations in the area. Exact locations unknown. Tech priests predict moderate hostile presence. So, from the data, and because of the level difficulty, I can't change and since it's a level 20, it gives you a damage dealt. So you can do 11% plus 11% more damage, and whatever damage you take, it will kill you for So I have a 8.9% so I won't take much damage so if he attacks me right nothing but when I attack him the health goes down fast very <laughs> fast and it's just oh, it's satisfying you know Same that day. And I'm not like favouring the Imperium side. I'm still a big I'm still quite a big fan of the chaos. So again I'm not gonna wait change sides. It's all going to be chaos, and I love being destructive type. Instantly just destroyed them. You know what, I'm just gonna hold down the R2 if it's gonna be like one tap. So, because I've never seen so much carnage. Wait, hang on, wait, I just need to clear this area. Chest up, damn it. Wait. Inbound. This is a little bit of strategy, so once they get a bit more closer, right? Right for you. It's just right. again. Sometimes they will come wait right, from the left, from the right. Middle and all that, and we 
God, done. Data transfer complete. Terminating access. We've got a good deal of information, but there's more. You get away, Chaos. Terrifying because you had to wait to bolt back a few times when you bolt back a bottle, but like, just to try and damage him. Right, how cool is that? Oh, we can go to the one at the top and then we'll probably work. Do, 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 do. But the funny thing is, I don't know if there's any like big raid types in this. You know, like finding like, the hidden treasure or what. So it's very kind of like an old carbon piece from game. I love it, but I'm gonna try it um, again. I'm the one I'm done with this. It's the mission I'm definitely gonna be trying out. So again, some missions you can get like allied um, soldiers to back you up. Be like one of my little treat little games that I'm going to be back. I will be like, uh, most fun. And I know there's no a lot new, any not any more new content, uh, which is kind of sad. Really good to the Warhammer game. Network. Um, I do play. I did play with playing in the, in the for the channel uh, Space Hulk. I got myself back into that again. Kill away one of the big, big ass enemies. It sometimes you get like the the, the one one demons coming out. And they would start like hounding your ass. And I'm having bad luck finding any chests in this game. So it's not. I'm not that bored of for luck for that. But at least I'm. I don't know, at least there's one thing I'm happy about: kill fighting enemies, big enemies. That's a small one. Ah well. Still got 
I'll get some good stuff out of you. Like that, so happy with that. Uh, and it's just up We're done. Easy get jumps. Sometimes if you want to win, if you want to get the higher loot. One of the items I got equipped that it will do small damage, but it's still like Network. Warning. Hostile <coughs> units inbound. Don't need to worry about my health, right? Because again. or a space marine wanna be. After all that, I am not going to be fucking happy. <coughs> oh, here we go. More jet to stop. So, this is all like, once you did this for a good amount, it will give you that. Now, it's giving you like more of a briefing. Like, finding like the, give you the steps and stuff. and. God, I love this game. Character sheet. So this is mo this is where my damage is, very much, and it's kind of cool how my defenses are, my offensive stuff, and it's kind kind of cool. And the time you hit level thirty, you get way like, more of these, and it's amazing. Now. I am a bit worried what will happen, but uh, you know what? Oh. You know what? I'll try a 1v1. <sighs> Alright, so this is gonna suck, but I'm giving it a go. 
I thought it was wait f wait four feet four for this, so let's just see what happens and then <sighs> if it doesn't show up it and then I know it probably just died out. But I did get an a couple of notifications that from what was it, a couple of days ago that there were people were doing like uh, in a big group with, with just four of them playing the campaign which was cool but I've always wanted, I'm kind of curious about the, the multi, the PvP side of things and I've never done any PvP style on this or Diablo so because I'm always like happy and it's not gonna happen is it? Well, that's a bust. So again, I'm going to leave this episode here. Um, what well, episode to start? Review for you guys if you like this. Um, so far, I actually do like this game. Um, and as you know, I've been having a lot of fun. And I mean, a ah, fuck ton of fun. And I also have a blueprint, which is cool, right? That's kind of cool, but you get money for it, and look at how much you get. Well, how much? Look at how much credits you get for just doing it. It's amazing, um, and it tells you what things is what, what things are good. I'm not getting rid of any of those because again, it's worth it, <coughs> and that's pointless. Um, but yeah. So I'm going to leave us here, um, so, sadly it's, there's no one will be any much on that, but if I go on to here, the only things that's available is that, because each one of them are like, I thought I bought the DLC, but it looks like I need, yeah I need the, I need wait that. So there is like some stuff you need to get. Yeah, um, wait, certain DLCs you have to unlock to order to get the new one. But the only ones that are available are like this one and this one. So I will be doing more of them. If you want to see a, a highlight video of this again, let me know in the comments down below. But like I said, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed me playing a, a kind of like a, a fun little casual relaxing game um i've been doing i've been playing this most of all my life anyway wait like, been for the past couple of days so and i'm having so much fun um stuff and i will put on uh, i'll show you That's right, different classes. So you got like the assassin, you got like the psycho, and the tech, the tech with that and stuff. And then, I'm not like, a big fan of the name, I just love being the big guy with the big guns. So that's me for you. Um, so if you like that, let me know what you think of it. And if you are interested in this game, you can find it on the PlayStation Store, or Xbox, or Steam. Any console, I don't know about Switch, so you can always have a look. But again, leave a like it down below. Uh, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, hit that, no hit that notification bell, join that mighty legion, and I'll see you guys in the next one. And also, tonight I will be posting more Lost Judgment, so be ready for that. Because I'm going to be doing like probably four or five episodes of that, and then after that, tomorrow will be up. Peace out guys, bye! bye.